guys one of the most interesting concepts in android 12 material you theming that you can customize that dynamic theming according to your own preference if you don't want that wallpaper based theming then repainter and android app which is available on the google play store by k dragon and for your information it's not a free app it's actually a paid app and it's not a promotional video it's just from my own preferences from my own experience and i've purchased this app and you are able to see that i am downloading from google play store i have purchased this so i don't think so any of you should comment like i'm using a pirated app or anything else like that if you set up the repainter app for the first time you will see this kind of screen startup screen and you have the option to use the app with the root access or shizuku and if you don't know what is shizuku video available on my hindi channel make sure to check out that if you want to use it without root with the help of shizuku what is shizuku and how to set up i have a dedicated video make sure to check out that you can customize the color if you want to customize the color i think so in my case if i want to apply the red color which i sometimes use on my device click on done and you're able to see that the red color is applied let me try let me show you by uh, installing by checking out the my quick settings panel and as you can see the red color is there and like this you can customize the colors of course in some custom rooms you get this feature by default but in other custom rooms like the stock one and if you don't want to root your device and if you don't want to use a custom room stock android 12 whatever you are using then you need this a repainter is actually looking good in some custom rooms i got this feature but in some it is not available and including that it will give you this kind of dynamic theming in almost all the apps whatever you need repainter is a very good choice if you have checked out the youtube you might see a lot of youtubers have already made a video on repainter and i think so it's not a bad deal i think it's worthy to have that you need to buy this app on your device for sure if we talk about some other features or extra options which we have pure black background some extra options like ignore muted colors only use saturated colors from the wallpaper you can even customize the per widget colors which feel something interesting and including that of course you have the option to customize it with root or shizuku the best part is you can use it with shizuku without rooting your device that seems good one of the interesting things let me tell you one more thing as you can see i have applied this theming on my device this color on my device right now if i want to check out some other colors as you can see this looks quite good a whole color chart is available and including that if i move on to the color and wallpaper section you have the option to extract the wallpaper colors for example the wallpaper has five to six or seven colors and whichever color i want to apply as my wallpaper i can choose that one that looks quite good this is why i just love this app a lot if you want to install this app link for the play store is already available in the description go and purchase it if you like it but if you don't want to use it if you don't like it simply ignore this i'm not forcing anyone to install this thanks for watching and goodbye Like I'm floating through the air